Hi, my name is Jennifer Palmer and this summer I've been researching in the Neurodegenerative Diseases Lab thanks to the generous support of an OMRF Wilkinson Summer Research Scholarship. I've always been fascinated by the brain, how 1.5 kilograms of squishy goo comes together with the greatest complexity of anything in the known universe to make us who we are. And I've been especially interested in what goes wrong in neurodegenerative diseases when our brains stop functioning normally. There is a group of fatal neurodegenerative diseases called Batten's disease that affect young children. These symptoms include seizures, going blind, difficulty with movement and problems with their memory and concentration. It's like an accelerated form of Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, epilepsy and blindness all combined into one disease. Batten's disease is due to problems in the cellular recycling system of brain cells. If a city suddenly stopped disposing of its rubbish, there would be a huge mess, things would get smelly, and people would get sick. The same things happen in your cells when they can't deal with their waste molecules correctly, leading to cell death and neurodegeneration. We know that mutations in a protein called CLN5 causes Batten's disease. However, we don't know very much about this protein, except that it works in the cellular recycling factory. My research has focused on trying to work out what job the CLM5 protein plays in the cellular recycling system. We need to understand what this protein normally does in order to find a treatment for this childhood neurodegenerative disease. A better understanding of the cellular recycling system could also lead to new drug targets to help cells cope with toxic waste and other neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. 